It's time for the adventures of Reed and Chris. Our story begins with Reed and Chris stopping by WVLE Radio. What are we doing at the radio station? I thought we'd stop in and see what Dwayne Page is up to. Hey, Dwayne, what are you, what are you up to? Oh, I'm building a time machine. A time machine? Really? A real one? Yeah, I get bored out here being at the radio station all day. Gee, Dwayne, couldn't you just play solitaire like everybody else does at work? I just take these old spare parts from the radio station, and I think I've got it working. Time machine? That's pretty cool. What's this red button do? No! WJLE's changed. Well, the calendar on the wall says 1985, and that looks like Ralph Vaughn in the DJ booth. Come on, let's go see him. Hi, everybody. This is Ralph Vaughn broadcasting on WJLE, the voice of the Center Hill Lake area. This portion of my program brought to you by Flutie's in downtown Smithville. Flutie says, Nike, 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 Nike. Remember the words, Nike, 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 at Flutie's in downtown Smithville. Yep, that's Ralph Vaughn. Friends, let me remind you, if you have never shopped at Walker's Shoes and Cheese on Broad Street in Smithville, you've got a treat coming. You say, shoes and cheese? Well, let's think about it. You eat cheese, you get strong and you get neutralized, and then you can buy a pair of shoes. Walker's Shoes and Cheese on Broad Street in Smithville. Shoes and cheese? Really? Welcome to 1985, buddy. Something about that just ain't right. Well, let's go in and see it. Mr. Vaughn? Hey guys, come on in and spend some time with me. Would you like something to drink while you're waiting? Well, yeah, I could, uh, I could go for a Coke. I have new Coke, and I also have classic Coke. Which do you prefer? Oh, definitely classic Coke. Yeah, classic Coke. We'll, we'll both take classic Coke, and believe me, everybody else will too. I'll be right with you. Let me tell you my positive punch for today. The positive punch today is the sun always shines. It's just according to your altitude if you see it or not. Now, the way the positive punch works is this. You take a thought and you you think about it. You think, well, this is something important. And then you relate to it. And then you assimilate. Or in assimilation, it's kind of like the actor's rule. You fake it till you make it. So you relate and you assimilate the thought for the day. The sun always shines. It's just according to your altitude if you see it. And right now, let me present Ricky Skaggs with his great new song, Country Boy. Hey boys, what can I do to help you? Hey, Mr. Vaughn, uh, uh, we're, we're from the future. We're actually the, the host of uh, Ben Herman's show in, in 2014. Well, I'm, I'm here looking out the window, but I don't see a DeLorean automobile. Don't you have one of those? I'm thinking about the movie Back to the Future. No, I ain't got no DeLorean, no. Huh? No, we came here in a time machine built by Dwayne Page. You know Dwayne. So you're telling me that you're going to host Ben Herman's radio program on WJLE? Yeah, we're, we're hosting Ben's show. Now, let me be honest with you. I, I, I'm trying to be candid. I'm trying to be honest. But for someone to host the Ben Herman show on WJLE, it needs to be someone with upstanding character. I'm thinking about maybe um, O.J. Simpson, maybe Pete Rose or somebody like that. You're going to have a disappointing next few years. Hey, Ralph, ain't you changing jobs here pretty soon? To tell you the truth, I'm going to be leaving WJLE because I'm going to become a financier. I'm going to be a big-time investor. I've been saving every penny I could, and I'm going to invest in Sony Betamax. 
Whoa, 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 whoa. No, I, I, I don't think I'd do that, Ralph. Let me tell you, save your money, wait till next year, and when you see the initial public offering of Microsoft, spend every penny. Well, I think I'd better do a little checking myself. I'm not sure about you guys. I think I'll call Sheriff Dwight Mathis and see if he has any kind of run on you guys, just to make sure you're on the up and up. Sheriff Mathis? Is he related to the Mayor of Liberty? He sure is. We better get out of here. Look, Reed, he's calling on his cell phone. Looks like he's calling in an airstrike. Seriously, we better get out of here. That sheriff's got my number. Quick, push the green button. Where did you goobers go with my time machine? Reed, we're back. Y'all were gone for about four or five minutes. Yeah, we went back to 1985 and met Ralph Vaughn. Yeah, th there was shoes and cheese and, and two Cokes and the mayor was sheriff. Well, yeah, the 80s were a very confusing time for a lot of us. Hey, Dwayne, what, what happened to Ralph Vaughn? Well, he's Ralph, he's a multi-millionaire. He got in early on Microsoft and made a fortune. Well, imagine that. We must have checked out okay with that sheriff after all. Tune in next week when you hear Chris say, We need to have a talk with Ralph. <laughs>